today I want to show you something else with fractions. We're going to look at some fraction relationships. Here I have one half. And I'm wondering if I can fit any other pieces from another family into this space that, that one half takes up. Let's see. Oh, it doesn't, no, I can't. Thirds will not fit in there. Let's see. Aha, two fourths fits in that space. So I'm gonna leave that out on the table because they take up the same amount of space. Let's try fifths. Mm, no. How about six? Aha! So three sixths takes up the same amount of space as one half. Let's leave that one out. How about sevenths? Mm, it's not going to fit another one. Let's try eighths. Aha, uh -huh. so four eighths takes up the same amount of space as one half. Let's try ninths. Well, it's not going to fit in there, is it? Ah, five tenths fits in there. Each of these fractions has equal value. They take up the same amount of space. They are equivalent. So one half equals two fourths, which equals three sixths. which equals four eighths, which equals five tenths. All of these fractions are equivalent. I wonder if you could find some other equivalent fractions. 